Hello everyone, TNG here back with episode 34 of my Ratchet and Clank Internet Nexus playthrough. Alright, last time we left off, we made it into the next water rising area place of death. And we're just going to fly all the way down and obviously start activating that. And this time, we're not going to fuck up, well, I'm still not, con yeah. I'm still not sure yeah, that was my fault. Pretty sure it was Clank's for not telling me what to do. Douchebag. Seriously. Like, wait until the water rises above the clank, the bolt crank, and say, Well, you should probably turn the bolt crank. Just saying. Now... Few enemies around. You know, as much as I'm not liking how long it takes to level this thing up, I'm think. Whoa, whoa, nearly walk off the edge then. I'm thinking it's the best idea is to level it up. Alright then. When they cross over, we're all out of work. It's something to beat up. Out of ammunition already. Ugh. Look, look, in the long run, it looks like you don't have to use it much in order to level it up. I don't know. Let's have Zircons kill them. Real quick. Come on, level up, level up, level up, level up. I know you want to. Really? Oh, so close. So close. That sucks. Let's just blow those up real quick while we blow up this gate here. Yeah. Just take a few shots. Wait, that one only takes one shot. Weird. I've already gotten the Golden Bolt in this level, of course, since, you know, it's a challenge mode playthrough, so... You don't have to collect those again. I am running out of jetpack fuel. I should have probably topped up before I came here. Just have the Zircons finish them off a bit. Come on, Zircons, level up. You know you want to. Yeah, here we go! So... 300% more ammunition, but I get the feeling. Going commando. Wow, that's cool. Nice reference. There's the power socket, but where's the battery box? Battery box down below. That said, I'm wondering. Like, it said 300% ammunition. I get the feeling that that used to say 200% ammunition or something. So it's not actually going up by 300%. Let's have a look at this real quick. It says 6 ammunition still, so why does it say it increased it? Because it didn't. Actually, um, I didn't, I didn't read a new ability for that at all. I don't think. Um, not that I could see. Uh, oh, um, I guess there's no new ability for it being level six, really? That's, that's kind of shitty. I would have actually really preferred it if, I don't know. I mean, like, you go to the trouble of leveling it up to level 6, you know, you kind of deserve a new ability, don't you? Oh, there's Silphid down here? Oh no, that's just the battery bot making a noise. Alright then. And now it's a race against time, because this is a really hard thing to do. Not really. Um, Alright then. Yep, I see. Hang on. That's right, we'll the fans start up. I forgot about that, eh? Oh well. We'll be right. I wonder if that actually hurts you on the right hand side. It'd be interesting to see. Well, no it wouldn't, because I'm not going to bother. <laughs> um, obviously doing really good on time here though, that's for sure. Oh, nearly screwed that up. Does that water hurt you? Because water seems to hurt you in this game. I'm curious, I'm curious. No it does not. So, some water doesn't hurt you. But regular water does. I don't know. I mustn't. He really mustn't like swimming. Must be a, a major concern of his. Let's charge up real quick. Is that they're supposed to be? Yeah, there are. Okay, there we go. Um, you know what? Let's use. Whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. Let's do that real quick. See if I can't. Yes, I did. That's some XP for them. Uh, a little bit of XP. Quickly turn we this bolt crank. 
Hopefully we make it in time. Oh, uh -huh, we made it in time. That was a close one, huh? So it seems like the water stops at a set, like, not at a set level, but rather at the level that you stop the bolt crank. You know what would be really nice? Is if you, instead of having the rhino plane up there, it would have been nice if the rhino plane had been, say, just beneath this platform. In order to get it, you had to beat the water just fast enough. But then again, at the same time, if you miss it, you would have missed it. Yeah, that's not very good, yeah. Oh, well. Um... Yeah, Zergon's level 6 and they didn't get no new abilities. That's really sucky. What's the way out again? I forget. Oh, here. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Um... There's the train station. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. Let's do... There's not one there. Well, Aha! I there are some over here, though. Let's do that. Oh! Wait, they leveled up! Nice! Awesome. Uh, what's the ability for this? New ability, black market reloading press creates a black holes that vanquish enemies into oblivion. Nice. Do that then. Just trying to watch. I'm not seeing no black holes or anything. I'm seeing rotanium though, that's nice. Um Yeah, at this point I'm just gonna use the nether blades just to tear this thing to shreds. And get some XP going for it. That'd be nice. Seems like this is pretty easy to avoid, just hold right stick, honestly. Look at that. It's completely... In oh, wow. I'm actually forgetting that I need some, uh... Fuel here. I need... Some Zircons, is what I need. Right then. I find it hum humorous as well, not humorous. Humorous. Alright, uh... What else have we got here? Something that I can level up. Hey, let's do this. Surprisingly, not that hard. <laughs> I can press select to see the planet map. I don't really want to see the planet map, though. Yeah, man, that takes way too long to level up. Way too long. Seriously, like... I can understand maybe if it was level 2 to level 3, but level 1 to level 2? And it's like... What? Not even halfway there yet? That's pretty shitty. That really is pretty shitty. Um, you know what I haven't done is the Nether Beasts. Hmm. Kinda wanna do that, because they're actually a pretty decent weapon. Um I'm thinking though for Nefton I might just I might just say f screw it and just kill him with the Rhino. Right I think it would make the fight easier. I mean, we are. So I am on legendary mode here, so let's be realistic. Um, perhaps I can be of assistance. Perhaps you can. Perhaps. Uh, before we do that, though, let's blow up these crates here too, because we can. Right then, what do we got here? Is it no? It's it's. Where is it? It was there. That's so weird. You would have thought I was looking at that properly. Uh, oh right, this one's the... Yep, you gotta go down the bottom left to do it. So, do that. Do that. And then to the right. Then left, I believe. Hmm. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I've... 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 Alright, that's what you're gonna do. You're gonna do that. And then to the right. And then... No. Hmm. Hmm. I might have actually already stuffed this up. Perhaps. I don't know. Seems like I've got it now. Now, with that down, it won't be able to move, and then I can just push it up. Yeah, okay. So it's a matter of knowing the exact way, the exact setup of getting that. Otherwise, you're not going to get the skill point. Because um, obviously, I was trying to figure it out, and I figured it out pretty fast. But nowhere near fast enough. Nowhere near fast enough. Which is a bit, uh, annoying. So, go through here. Wait for this to go down. Uh, wait for that. Let's go through. Oh, shit. Alright, that's fine. Do you actually... I think you actually come back for this one, don't you? No. Surely not. Actually, then again, you might. I don't know. 
Alright, where am I going for this? Ah, oh, the crate's down the bottom here. Okay. Move it across. Um, right, you need to set the gravity up like that. Move it across, move it down. Move it to the right all the way. Uh, move the gravity up. Move the platforms left. Move the gravity down. Up. And left. And up. Cool. Pretty straightforward stuff. Ah, they do want me to go backwards. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, wow, that sucks. Damn, that does a lot of damage. I've only been hit twice. And only by a small one as well. Hmm. Just trying to uh, get past. Oh, oh, I made it. It's fine. Alright, we should be good from here. A few more of these, but they're not as intense as the last few. Um, now, I, I forget how to get back through to the start, though. The start looks like it might be difficult. That was a close shave. Is it? No, oh, wow. The start's really easy, surprisingly. Now, if I get a skill point for that, that's pretty bad, because it took forever on some of those puzzles. Good work, pal. Nah. Not so bad. Alright then. Um, yeah, I can easily tackle Neftin in this episode. I'm gonna do that now. Let's activate this bolt crank. We'll click those bolts that are laying around here, of course. We're nearly halfway to the Rhino, so that's pretty promising. Um, I mean, obviously, it would be nice to upgrade some Good more work, weapons, now let's go get but I kind of want to do the Rhino. I really do. Let's hop on, shall we? Triangle. Activate the elevator. And let's not stand on the rail tracks. They tend to be pretty dangerous. Just, just tend to be a little bit. Here comes the train. Uh, unless we skip. Alright then. Um, we've got you guys out. That's level 3 already. Frog blades can level up a bit, but nope. We're going with the Rhino. Rhino! I know you don't want to do this. You know nothing, you little space rat. Why do I? Why does Ratchet always get called cool a space rat? Seriously. It's so mean. Oh, crap. I forgot he does this electricity stuff. I'm already half dead. That's actually really painful. Damn. Wow. Huh. This could be more problematic than I thought it would be. Hmm. Wait, what? There's actually vendors and stuff down here? Huh. That's pretty cool. There's actually a teleporter here to leave the level as well. Hmm. Nice. Well, let's activate the elevator and try this again. Shouldn't have too much trouble. I just gotta avoid stuff more. Um... Just trying to think. I wonder what the Peacemaker does in the way of damage. Not much. When he gets out of electricity, though, that's real painful. Shit. It's kind of difficult to avoid. Now, where's he dropping it? Right there. Alright. We've, we've phased. Have we phased? We've phased. Good. You're gonna pay for what you did to my friends. They were in our way. Um, hopefully. What am I paying you for? That's interesting. So, that was interesting. Huh. So when I pause the game... And again. So, they play the train sound when the thing's paused, and when the train comes past, there's no train sound. I find that humorous. I really do. Trust that's me. that's really funny. You don't want to use that dimensionator. That creature can't be trusted. If it hurts Vendra. I won't let that happen. Don't just stand there and do something. Yes, sir, Mr. Pro. We'll take care of it. Your car. He does your car. Has me with a killing. One more? Hopefully this is the last one, I imagine. Alright then. That should be the last of them. No, not not the last of them. Gee. It feels as almost... Ah, there we go. He's back. And it looks like he actually gained back his health as well, which is... Oh boy, he's right beside me. 
Damn you. That's a bullshit hit right there. You spawned right beside me and hit me. Cheap ass. The hell? What did I die to then? I... Was I hit by something then? I must have been hit by something. That's insane. Wow. Um, well, I guess we're gonna have to end the episode here, though, anyway, everyone, because it's obviously more than a, a one-minute fight. So, thank you so much for watching episode 40, uh, so 40, yeah, episode 40, episode 34, rather. Uh, that's where I got the four from, of my Ratchet and Clank Instant Nexus playthrough. And until next time, have a good day. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and post a comment below to tell me how I can improve. And feel free to subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Oh, that's one shot. What the hell killed me then, though?